What's up guys, JBA here and today I'll be showing you how to install Kodi 16 on your iPhone or iPad without a jailbreak. If you happen to be one of those lucky people who are jailbroken, I got you covered. Later in this video, I'll be showing you how to get Kodi 16 on your jailbroken devices. If you enjoy this video or find it useful, be sure to show some love by hitting that like button, sharing this video, and subscribing to the channel. If you want to see behind the scenes or whatever I may be up to, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat at JailbreakOrmy. If you're unfamiliar with Kodi, it's a program that gives you the ability to watch and stream free and live TV and movies. That includes NBA League pass games, pay-per-view content like boxing, and pretty much any movie or show that you can think of. Now, as I said before, you do not need to be jailbroken to use this method but it will work for you just the same if you are. Unlike the jailbroken method, this method is not permanent. Without a developer account, which will run you around $99 for a full year, this will only work for seven days before you have to redo the process. Even though this is an inconvenience, you're still getting all of this free content that you otherwise would have had to pay for. Personally, I recommend that you go ahead and drop $30 or so on the fire stick and get a permanent solution without having to deal with all of this jailbreak and non-jailbreak stuff. Just plug it into your TV. And if you're interested in that, I'll leave links in the description below. But if you're not jailbroken, follow these steps. The first thing that you need to do is download Cydia Impactor and Decody IPA to your computer. I'll be sure to leave a link to that below. Once you have Cydia Impactor open and installed, go ahead and plug your device into your computer. Now what you need to do is drag the Kodi IPA file onto Impactor. Next, you need to enter your iTunes login information and click start. This is safe, so don't worry about anyone stealing your login information or anything like that. As an added safety measure, I guess, it's actually required that you create an app-specific password for the process. I named mine Kodi and I'll leave a link below for that as well. Once the process is finished, you'll see that Kodi is now installed on your device. Okay, so by now you should be seeing the untrusted developer notification pop up when you try to open Kodi. Here's how to fix that. Open settings, navigate to general, device management, developer app, and by that I just mean you should see your iTunes ID right there and select trust and then trust again. Now Kodi should open up without a problem. Now if you're jailbroken and want a more permanent method, just follow these steps. The first thing that you need to do is open Cydia and make sure that you have iFile installed. You'll need this in just a moment. Next, use Safari to navigate to Kodi.tv slash download. I'll be sure to leave a link to that in the description. Now that you're on that page, scroll down to the section that says current release, Kodi v16.1 Jarvis. Select iOS and in parentheses it should say jailbroken and click right there where it says .dev file. Now it's important that you leave the blank page that appears open. Believe it or not, Kodi is downloading in the background. After Kodi finishes downloading, a screen will appear that gives you the option to open Kodi.dev file in iFile. Select open in iFile, click install, and click done. Now, if you don't see Kodi, it's because you need to respring your device. For some reason, simply respringing with tweaks like PowerTap didn't do the job for me. And the same could be true for you. If so, hop into Cydia and install, uninstall, or update any tweak that requires a respring. After your device resprings, you should find Kodi right there on your springboard. And if you're unfamiliar with Kodi, you may be shocked to find that it's empty. Although it does give you the ability to watch and screen free and live content, there is none upon install. If you would like me to upload a video showing you some of the best Kodi plugins that I have found, smash that like button, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat at JailbreakOrmy. And until next time, stay weird, get curious, and be you. Later, guys.